the football world. Beneficiaries of Christian Achu's humanitarian works and admirers across the globe will bid farewell to the winger of great repute on Friday, March 17. The 31 year old who was a pride for Ghana, a humble man with a heart so pure, was caught up in Turkey's earthquake in early February. His burial and Thanksgiving service is scheduled for 9 a.m. on Friday at the forecourt of the State House. Before that, the public will file past his remains from half past 6 a.m. on Friday. The ex-Chelsea and Newcastle player will be interred at his hometown, Dogobome, near Ada in the Greater Accra region. Preparations for the late footballer's final rites are underway as spokesperson of the Trasam family, Robert Annie, details. Preparations are underway when you go to the grounds now. Uh, trusses are being mounted. The canopies are also being mounted over the, the stage is also being done for His Excellency, the President of the Republic, and the people he will be coming with. And uh, things are getting ready. Almost all the logistics are ready at site, and we, we are trying to be ready for tomorrow. I believe uh, some of the diplomatic corps will also be coming. The Turkish embassy, they've played a pivotal role in the whole process right from the beginning till Chris was brought home and he even came home to pay homage and sign the book of condolence. And uh, I think some former ministers, uh, the president will be coming with his entire agent. If the president is moving, you know the kind of people he moves with. So we are expecting everybody. Atu won 65 caps for Ghana and scored nine times. With grace and skill, he moved so fast. AFCON 2015 was the height of his prowess for the senior national team. He won the player of the tournament and scored the goal of the tournament, but failed to win the trophy as Ghana finished second. Former national teammates, representatives from the Ghana Football Association, Ghana Premier League clubs, the Professional Footballers Association of Ghana are all expected to grace the occasion. However, foreign-based Black Stars players will miss the ceremony due to club assignment. It's unfortunate, but, you know, we all can't have things the way we want it. And maybe the 24th or next week that they may be available for the funeral. Some people will also not be available. And I don't think we can ever find a day that is convenient for everybody. So we just have to adjust and then do this and do it now. Most of them have been in touch and they've expressed their sincere uh, condolence. And we also understand that they are working and their clubs wouldn't allow them to come. Seeing that there is an international break in the coming days. So we understand them and it's unfortunate, but we bear with anybody that wants to come and is not able to make it. This is where we brought into now and we just need to move forward and bring this chapter to a close as as quickly as possible. Both on and off the pitch, Achu was a shining spark. From sponsoring orphanages to rescuing convicts, his humanitarian works transcends borders. The world will clad in black attire on Friday for a true inspiration for both young and old. Oh,